What's going on, everybody? I'm Egypt Propy Jam. Welcome back to Life is Strange 2. Oh, yeah. We're kind of we're picking up right where we left off. Yeah. Um, they've just returned from hey, going shopping. Up? I think we've hey. done this bit before, Morning. so we're just gonna play like a little bit of it. How was the town? Uh, again, just so I can remember <laughs> where we're up to. People look at us as if we're aliens. Here come the sand people. <laughs> The deserters I was talking to um, Consistent Cody, Cody, who was in the comments of the last video. <laughs> I kind of agree. This guy with the ponytail, I don't remember his name, but um, we'll see. he's like the same character type as David <laughs> from season one. What's your secret? Defying death on a daily basis. And hide rating. Oh, right. Can't forget your goodies. <laughs> so apparently they supply the entire like ah, weird town yes, that we've got here. Catch you later. Take care. Hey, so how did you guys like your night in the canyon? It was good. It was amazing. So Hell yeah, stars. it was. It's so quiet. What a cool way to Calm wake up. Here. I knew you'd like it. Like I said, like that Glad last, um, that. in the last episode, Hi, it was like that cool shot of them overlooking the canyon. How was the town? Town life always sucks. <laughs> but we got something for you. What'd you get? Whoa, yes! Thanks, David. It is. You want to play cat? Oh, his name was David. Totally. There we go. Me and Dad always used to play, but I'm way better now. I also like. I like how open he can kind of be with no his powers what now. He's been through. He just wants to be a kid, and play. Yep. Daniel hasn't been like this in forever. You've all been a good influence on him. Oh, Time you boys just froze. Him. Jesus. Hope Daniel didn't get scared by all the critters. Yeah, not anymore. Yeah, he's seen a lot worse. I was about to say that. And that made him tougher. And he can defend himself. You're right. And he does like to show off. Maybe a little too bit. much. A little bit. You boys have been here over a month. And I still can't get over Daniel's... <sighs> Abilities? <laughs> Me neither. Me neither. But I never figured it out. So I don't try anymore. Well, take it from an old soldier. But you trained him well. He's a good kid. Pre season one? Is this David before like he goes to Arcadia Bay or something? Because David in season one was a soldier as well, wasn't he? But what do I know? Never met someone with a superpower before. I try to be a good It'd be kind of interesting if that's the way that it, that they link it to uh, season one if this happens pre I don't know if I did um him running into Chloe's mum or and whatever that Listen, story ended up raising being. Raising a kid is the toughest job in the world. Trust me. Combat was easier. <laughs> That's comforting. How many kids? Oh. You didn't tell me you had kids. How many? <laughs> None. I was a stepdad. Or, in her case, a step douche. Is this David, like, pr after I'm season one? now. But I never. Oh, why is it like glitching out? Do the Stop right doing that. Thing for my stepdaughter. Is it? she died. Is it him? We were like oil and water, and she was always starting shit. I think this is David from That's season one, dude. Shit to get a new father, especially one like me. I just had no clue how to deal with her. Wish I did. Anyway, it's gotta be. You can't go back. Nope. Thanks for talking, David. Better start my delivery now. Hell yeah. Found some weird snacks in town. Arthur's gonna freak. <laughs> Catch you later, Sean. Oh. <laughs> okay. Time out. Oh, Good chat. Melt. That was awesome, Mom. Now I know why they don't play baseball in the desert. You throw way better than Sean. <laughs> I throw fine, bastard. Oh, we're not. God damn. Uh, food inside before it melts. Jesus no Christ. Problem. Bit of a glitch. She is so cool. You think? That's it. Joanne. It's just cool that he can do that. I'm still Sam amazed. So like cool. five the episodes so later. Cool. You're way too easy, bro. Whatever. Can't help it if I like Taryn. <laughs> She's pretty cool. You and I know. I'm just saying. Don't get too cozy here. This is a... Pit stop. 
Rest stop. I know. A bigger journey. Uh, ooh, pancox. One thing Claire and Karen have in common. Their love for pancakes. Hell yeah. Hope my crops will make it. Alright. Is that a new statue? Where are we? That woman is amazing. Take you as Beaky. What do we got on here? Laptop? Feels like a hundred degrees in that fucking trailer. Hundred and five degrees out here. What's on the USB stick? Whoa. Whoa. I should have gone through that flash drive weeks ago. Movies and stuff. Damn. Fair, fair enough. As you as you were. Alright, let's not go through that too much. Alright, let's head back out. Couple brews, couple cold ones. I have to admit, I do miss that Pacific Northwest weather sometimes. Yeah, <laughs> I bet. You've been here over a month now. What do you think of our little oasis? It's nice. It's another world. This place is like another world. Don't even know how to describe it. <laughs> I think you just did. It has a. It's like that, um, there's like a small town That's why just out of, like, Los Angeles, um, where it's like a bunch of, it's like an art Not community. Perfect, but it works. Kind of reminds me of that. If I find a picture of it, I'll, I'll put it up somewhere. It's it is peaceful. So peaceful out here. <laughs> Guess that's what everybody's really looking for. Peace. You're probably right. Yes. I still feel like we're really privileged out here. There's bad shit going on in this desert. Yeah. Bad? There's bad shit going on everywhere. Welcome to society. Get away from everything. You can't escape reality. Even here. We just live slightly apart from it. Yeah. How'd you find the place? So... How did you end up here? <laughs> this place is not on the map. Like most of us, I was first brought here by someone, Maggie. After I failed to make it in New York, I was lucky enough to meet her down in Florida. Hmm. She's had a tough life. This place was her getaway. She's long gone now, but oh. her name is that sucks. all over this place. Well, thanks for bringing us here. Yeah. Oh, Sean. I'm glad I was able to help you. By the way, can you grab your brother so we can all talk? She rats us out to the cops. That's how it ends. Okay. Uh, yeah, I just thought we could spend this day together. Just the three of us. Sure. Big brother to Superwolf. <laughs> we need you at Karen's trailer. Copy? Sure. I mean... Time for a little buddy. Ah, the awkward silences. <laughs> Compadre. How about a trek around the canyon today? Sure, why not? Totally. Let's pack then. Oh, that's a cool shot. I... I I think I said it in the last episode, I keep getting, like, Firewatch vibes every time they show, like, the landscapes of the canyons and everything. I need to go back and play that game. Firewatch I, is one of those series that um, I used to have an editor, and I feel like it was edited uh, you know, in the wrong way to kind of compromise the story a little bit, so I do kind of want to go back and do that at some point. Um... But we'll see how we go. We've still got heaps of games coming out this year that we that we need to focus on. And I'm going to try and get back to Death Stranding and Star Wars at, at some point as well. I do just want to finish off this uh, episode of uh, Life is Strange 2 and then we can go back. I'm beat. 
Oh, sorry. Just got one last thing to show you guys. I can't get enough of this place. <sighs> Come on, Daniel. Give me your hand. <sighs> it's good to see them in like the downtime. And this is kind of like the start of every episode I, I in this season. Slow down, Mom. You walk too fast. Is it <laughs> more walk, less talk. Is it they um they always show you in this like calm kind of like living the best life and then it gets torn apart nature's art that's kind of like the gimmick of this game in a way damn it's so big and pretty and so quiet hell Except yeah birds of prey Shh. listen serious if we're lucky yeah that's so cool Let's go up. Uh oh. Continue trekking. Wolf. Better be careful of hunters out here. The Wolf Brothers can't be trapped. You'd help us. Damn. Look you at that shot. The time, Mom. God no damn. Here, but that's enough for me. That's a cool Dan shot. Likes to come with me. Oh, I bet she would be fun to go hiking with. Well. Not when I go too fast. She's all about Damn. We usually find a good pace. Uh, usually. Joanna's like Sean. They make art, so they stop to look at stuff. You're way more like me. Fast. Yeah, I am like you, Daniel. So let's hurry up. <laughs> so you're not adopted. <laughs> That's where you get it from. Just taking in the silent moment here. It's nice. I love to come here to get away from <laughs> everything. <laughs> away. <laughs> I bet. It's the best spot. It's pretty damn good. Sit down. So, hey, I do appreciate that you guys stuck around this long. Thank Are we going to start heading uh, to... You helped us a lot. You actually helped us. You gave us a place to recharge. And Hell yeah. Lay low. No kidding. I was so beat down after Haven Point. Hmm. I know. This is the best place to take some time for yourself. Hell yeah. You don't get that chance very often in life. Just know I love both of you so much. And I'm proud of who you are. And where you're going. Oh. Do I put that pressure on? Sure. By the way, um, come with if us. If you wanted to, you could come with us to Mexico. That would be cool. I would love to come see you settled into a new home. But you're almost there. But I have to be upfront with both of you. What happened in Haven Point is catching up on us. Huh? Damn. What do you mean? I know the way here. We in town. Uh, we saw some stories in the papers. The feds are definitely tracking us down in the region. Shit. And they'll find us. All right. Wow. Time to skidoo. Figures. This can last forever. Can't have the simple life. Let's so uh. Life's strange, man. This is it. As the game title it suggests. We'll leave tomorrow. Nah, they're gonna be like tied on our tail though. 
Can you hand me that bag, Sean? One last photo. That's why I brought no? you back here. I made these for the 4th of July, but this is better. Oh, I love those things. Oh, cool. Whoa, awesome. Cool. That's so cool. Let's light up the sky. Oh, what a really cool shot. Damn. What a cool moment. That's so cool. That's super cool. One last night just to hang out and chill before it all starts going tits up again, as it inevitably will. Damn, what a moment. Okay, this episode's starting to kind of grow on me. As I said, I think uh, previously, I, I do want it to kind of start picking up that speed a little bit. I want it to start, uh, you feel like there's a bit of an urgency because I feel like the last couple of episodes have just been, I don't know, they felt very filler, so to speak. Where you kind of, you know you're heading towards a point, like the first episode really moved along really well. Second episode was eh. And then like the third and fourth episodes had beats where it was really good and then beats where it just dipped and, and felt like filler. So I'm hoping the rest of this episode kind of picks back up that momentum. All right. Um, Guess it's time. Are you guys all set up to leave? No. So that's we have to leave again. I think I'm kind of scared. Oh. Oh, honey. Ain't we all? What will you do now? What are you gonna do now? I wanna make this about uh, the family away. instead of it being. Not this time. <laughs> instead of it always just time. being about where the border is, what the next objective so is. So let's do ask about to, to Keep you. it family. It won't be easy crossing that border. So I'm gonna give you a head start on the police. Wait, how? What's your plan? The cops are after me too for what happened in Nevada. So they can catch me instead of you. Fair trade. No, that's rough. We'll go to jail for helping us. It's not about me right now. We need to get your asses to Puerto Lobos. You don't have to do that. You don't have to do this, Karen. I let you guys down before. Not this time. I knew what I was doing when I came to Haven Point looking for your brother. I felt... It was the right thing to do. And I feel the same today. Damn. I tried to live by my own rules. No matter what. I don't expect you boys to be like me. But try to stay true to yourselves. This is your life. Wise advice. Don't let anybody get in the way. 
Uh, yeah, let's do it. Fuck the rules. We'll do whatever we can to survive. Hell yeah. That's fair. Yes, it is. You took care of Daniel all the way from Seattle to Arizona. Nobody could ask for a better brother. Or son. Aww. Okay. Starting to get the touchy moments going. This is the last roundup. Wait, let me say bye to Joanne. All right. I'm gonna go do one last checkup on the truck before you hit it. Cool bananas. And don't forget what we talked about. It's your life, Sean. Uh, you should go see David. He has something for you. Okay. It has that has to be the dude from season one, hundred percent. So this is kind of, is this is what happened like afterwards, I guess. Like this is this has happened after the um. Oh, go with mom. Hell yeah. Hey mom. I know you're better with words than me, but still, here it goes. Gotta leave her a note. Ooh. Thanks for... I think I finally get you. Took me some time, but... I want to mend. I want to mend that relationship. I want it to be. I want it to be a good relationship by the time that we leave. So, I want it to kind of come back and be like, "I forgive you." Don't give up on your freedom. Please don't give up on your freedom. Okay. It's the best thing you've taught us. Hmm. Really is. We'll reach you once we find our own freedom. Thank you so much. Love. Sean. Wow. No, leave it as is. Hell yeah. Alright. Let's go... Let's go talk to... Where's David? He's in that caravan. Let's go talk to him and then we should be... Back on the road. Where's... Where's the door? We should go see what David wants now. There it is. Alright. Let's knock. I think after these guys leave, I think we'll leave the episode there. It feels like this is going to be a good way to break it up. Go grab that police scanner inside first. I got to put these new plates on the car. Sure. Come on. I'll join you when I'm done. Okie doke. Oh, they better not know we're here now. Feel like they're going to. There it is. Okay, how does this thing work? Toggle pal? Uh, okay. Only gotta search between 140 and... 160. 160. Having a lovely morning on string... Uh, no. Okay. So between 140 and 160. Let's have a look. This place has too many adults. Where is it? But I'm gonna miss it. That's all I'm saying, folks. But mm. back to uh, doesn't sound like cops. No. And here you go. Another hit from the Nope. Here we go. Wait, a ten ten. I feel like this is it. Oh, shit. Again? Ten four. 
Now we can spy on the cops all the way to Mexico. Hell yeah. Thanks, David. You big rebel. What a cool guy. And that's the thing, if this is David from season one, it's like, you compare season one to like this, in terms of character, like, damn, he's like almost unrecognizable. I'm glad that they crossed that over though, that, that feels like a really nice kind of, uh, tie into season one, because you get to see him a bit more chilled game. out and everything like yep. that, instead of being an uptight kind of asshole. How about that? Good job. Now, you'll always want to know what they're up to. No surprises on your way to the border. Hell nah. All right. This is the fastest route. When you get there, cross between these two stations. Now. Okay. You have to exit the main road and drive through the desert for a while. But Karen's car should be okay. You got all that? Hmm. Sure. I think so. Sean, you have to know. The police are on your ass. You, you I got it. Get I got one it. Chance here. I got you. Trying to be a dick. Just honest. I know, David. It says in Thanks. his tattoo says in um in memory of. Here. Have is that what it says? Don't is that uh, is around. that for Chloe? Because didn't because Chloe and died in uh, well in my playthrough of season one. Spoil was for that, when but uh, she played. died in my playthrough. But after watching you and your little brother for a while, I think I get what you're going through. Your experience forms you as a person. Hell yeah, it does. And I imagine all the shit you've seen and how it's changed you pretty much not comparing myself but I had to go through my own hell in war and at home yeah I didn't know how to deal with emotions or other people yes that was uh, very evident are you Talking about your stepdaughter? Hmm. Yeah. Some rich fucking kid shot her at school. Yep, I there it is. Her. Me and her hated each other on sight. Yep. But once I lost her, everything became clear. How selfish and wow, that I'd been. So did that carry over the choices that I made? In season one? Being a bully. Because my saves are still on here. So I wonder whether that pulled from season one. I'm not gonna fuck this up. God, this is way after then. Sean, like, this is after the... I'm gonna do everything I can to help you get out of here. Damn. That's my duty now. But... I want to be straight up with you. Okay? Yeah. Of course. I know you guys got screwed. But you think nobody will ever believe you. But the truth is on your side. You and Daniel can't just hide out forever. Is that how you see yourself in 10 years? Mm. If you step up. Very true. Face the law. He's very true. You can be free. Sooner. God, that's an interesting tie-in to season one. Hmm. Do I turn myself in? I don't know. Hmm. Turn myself in after I see what happens with Daniel. I know. As long as he's safe, that's uh. That's kind of Keep your yeah. Options open. Think about it. We'll reevaluate once he's yeah. safe. I I might reevaluate. Fast. Too fast. <laughs> That's what I'm worried about. You made it here, so 
I know you're on the right path. Okay. Well, that's that's a little more comforting. Oh. Uh, sorry. I really have to take this. Wow, that was a good chat. I did not expect that hey, from Joyce. Uh, right on Joyce. He still talks to her. She's from season one too, right? That was a uh, close mom. I'm good. I'm like I'm up the solar panel. Is that is that who he's speaking with? All right, let's let's have a look. Let's... Daniel, do you copy? Where is he going? It's time to wrap it up. So, here we go. To say goodbye to a way. Yeah, kind of sad. I know. Are we leaving yet? We have to, and I know. Come here. Oh. Kind of gonna miss them. Um, I, I'm gonna miss you. Oh. I'll miss you too. Same. It was amazing to spend this time with you. I'm so damn proud of you both. And what you're going to do with your life. And if you ever need me, I'm just around the corner. Okay, Mom. Hell yeah. Thank you. Well, Sean. Oh, she's, she's got tears. God damn. Nah, she gets a hug. She gets a hug, man. Thanks, Mom, for being there. Thanks for letting me, son. That's the first time that he's... Ah, uh, it's the first time he's called her mom. Well, to her face. He's always called her Karen. Let's the road. Kind of sucks having to leave. I mean, I know that they're they have to continue their goal and shit, but always sucks when they do this in the Take game. Care, boys. They make you get like they really say. connected to the community, and then they're just like, "No, nah, you now you move on." That's it. Ooh, damn. Shit, that was, um, I didn't expect that I was gonna kind of get a little bit choked up there. Um, but that was an interesting way for them to tie in uh, season one to this episode. Um, I am going to leave this episode here. Um, we will come back and finish this off. I think we've got like another hour, so another one or two episodes uh, to go. But um, keen to know what you guys are thinking so far of this episode. Um, so let me know down below. But anyway. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to favorite it. Don't forget to subscribe if you've not already, guys. Helps me out a lot. There are links to social media is in the description box. And as always, until next time, I'm YouTube's Pope and Peace out. So